This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at the temperature dependence of the KW. In a previous video, we saw that the ionic product constant of water, the KW, is equal to the concentration of hydrogen ions multiplied by the concentration of hydroxide ions. The KW has a value of 1.00 times 10 to the negative 14 at 298 Kelvin. In this video, we'll look at how temperature affects the value of the Kw. Here we have the equation for the dissociation of water to form hydrogen ions and hydroxide ions. The dissociation of water requires energy. This means that the forward reaction is endothermic. If we apply Le Chatelier's principle, we can predict in which direction the position of equilibrium will shift when the temperature is increased or decreased. Because the forward reaction is endothermic, an increase in temperature shifts the equilibrium to the right and the concentrations of H plus and OH negative ions increase. And because the reverse reaction is exothermic, a decrease in temperature shifts the equilibrium to the left and the concentrations of H plus and OH negative ions decrease. So from this we can see that a change in temperature will affect the concentrations of H plus and OH negative ions, which in turn will affect the value of the Kw. In this table we have the value of the Kw at three different temperatures. We can see that as the temperature increases, so does the value of the Kw. To find the concentration of hydrogen ions in pure water, we take the square root of the Kw. We can then find the pH of pure water by taking the negative log of the hydrogen ion concentration. So as we can see, as the temperature increases, the pH of pure water decreases. So the first point to note is that the Kw is temperature dependent. Therefore, the pH of pure water is only 7 at 298 Kelvin. However, pure water is still neutral at lower and higher temperatures, as the concentration of hydrogen ions is equal to the concentration of hydroxide ions. So at 273 and 313 Kelvin, pure water is still neutral despite having a pH greater or lower than 7. This is because the concentration of hydrogen ions is equal to the concentration of hydroxide ions.